Howdy gamers, old gamer guy here. Welcome to another Star <laughs> Starship uh, Stellaris console edition video. Um, I just noticed a couple of things uh, while I had the game paused in between uh, making the last video. One thing that I have noticed, and I don't know why, I don't know what changed, but for some reason, my construction ships are now able to come down here and do something. So I don't know what what caused that delay exactly. Maybe I was cut off by the pirate base that was here. I thought it was maybe this. But I don't think that makes sense because they're crossing back and forth in our space. And we are crossing like we're not hostile with each other. So I'm wondering if it was because there was a pirate base here and then we have the the uh, cult of light here so all of this stuff in between maybe was cut off to the construction ships I, I don't know but I am building I have one construction ship that's on its way to build a frontier outpost right here so I can cut off at least the expansion of their borders uh, although they could still build over here and then I guess I could do the same thing maybe like right here maybe I will do that I don't know but with this uh, construction ship I'm gonna come down here and first I'm gonna build a, uh, a mining station right there so that'll happen um, the science ships are occupied the fleet is here. I don't think they can be upgraded just yet. No. But the other thing that I noticed is at my spaceport, I am now able to upgrade to level 3. And so that will give me an extra module, at least one module. I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe more than one. I'm not positive. But... Uh, Definitely one module, I believe. <laughs> I believe definitely, possibly. Uh, but more importantly, it will allow me to build, I think, destroyers. Uh, a larger ship, anyway. So I'm going to do that. And um, right now, this fleet has eight ships in it. So I'm going to build two more corvettes and one destroyer whenever they're of it whenever they're available to build and then I'm gonna see how that stacks up against this uh, Church of Light fleet down that way Let's see what was that what happened there whoops damn it Upgrade, repair. Oh, oh that, that was them reaching maximum health. That's what that was. So the incoming upgrade. Transmission. Uh oh. An incoming transmission. A trade deal offer. The trading consortium, they are offering a trade deal. They want to give us minerals and they, an active sensor link in exchange for our active sensor link. I don't know if I want that. I've got a feeling that I don't know if we're gonna, if things are going to turn hostile with these guys eventually or not. But that an active sensor link will transfer full map vision to the other party for the duration of the trade deal. So it would be 15 years where they would be able to see what we're doing and we could see what they're doing. I'm going to decline this. Uh, ruthless capitalists and we are spiritualist seekers so I'm, I'm declining that but while I'm thinking about contacts here fragmented nation states okay these are the new people that we met Where are they? They're all the way over here. So 
so I'm not sure we're going to be able to defend each other or attack each other for any, you know, in the uh, foreseeable future. I was going to propose, well, I guess I will go ahead and propose a, uh, oh, I can't do any of that, I guess because maybe we're too far away. I was going to just do the non-aggression pact. Uh, yeah, okay. So I'm not going to do anything with them. Unpause. Research complete. We've got research complete. Unlocks a building heritage site. Okay. Pause for a second to look at our technology options here. Naval capacity would allow me to upgrade my naval capacity, derp, doctrine, reactive formations. I've got 19 possible, and I've only got eight ships right now, so I'm not really worried about that. Unlocks edict, uh, this, let's see, colonial centralization unlocks edict production targets, which will increase minerals by 15% for 10 years. And then it also unlocks a building, the planetary capital. That's interesting. And it has an adjacency effect. It, while it increases mineral, food, and energy output for adjacent squares. So that's interesting. And then the epigenetic trigger triggers, I could uplift a... <laughs> I like that picture of the ape with the suit on. Um, I could uplift a primitive situation, uh, primitive species, a pre, I guess, pre-sentient species. Yeah, allows genetically uplifting and socially integrating species which, which are close to being sentient. I'm going to do, oh man, this will take a long time to get. So will that, but I don't really need that. I'm going to do this. Because my spiritual seekers, even though they're they're smelly, so other people might not like them, but they are their hearts are in the right place, and they would like to uplift a primitive species. Okay, so let's see what is going on. One science ship is up there, otherwise occupied. This one. Okay, yeah, they're they're going to. Uh, that's right. They're they're going here to research, and then they're going here to research. Okay. And I guess maybe I should go ahead and check and see what is going on on Febreze. I bet I have some populations that are idle, and yes, I do. I've got one here. Everybody else is busy. What am I low on? I guess I could build a mine down here, or a mine here would be better to get more minerals. So I'll do that. I can only build a basic mine. And then I will move these guys up here so they will be ready to work when that mine is ready. And then, what's happening on Aroma? We've got an idle population here and here, and there's one growing here. We've got three idle populations, that's not good. And they're all, it's all food. Mining network. What can I build here? Oh, I don't have the min I don't have the minerals to build anything. So I should probably build something like a hydroponic farm or possibly a temple. Look at that. Uh, produces unity. So I might want to build a temple right there when I can, but I can't build anything right now. So unpause.
it's a construction ship. Spaceport upgrade ready in about 55 months or 55 days, I guess. Yeah. 45 days. That's pretty quick. And then I would be able to build what? A destroyer, I'm just, I think. I don't know. We'll see. We will see. We will see. System survey complete. Construction complete. A destroyer. Okay. And it'll take 215 minerals. And then I can add another module here. Construction complete. But I don't have any available to me. Okay. Let's see. Um, I need 215 minerals there. They're building a mining station. They're building the frontier outpost. So everybody's busy. And, uh, but at least we can build our destroyer. Complete. We can build our destroyer and then come down and take on these Church of Light bastards. Let's see what kind of research we've got here. Nano composite materials. Okay, so I can upgrade my ship armor. That's good. I can upgrade my fleet. I think. <laughs> oh, a defense station. I'm not at war, but that would be a good thing to have. Uh, a defense module, okay, that would be a good thing to have for my spaceport. I don't know how you build another spaceport on an, around another planet. I haven't really figured that out yet. I guess maybe this would be the best thing because it's it'll be quick. I'll I'll be quick to have it. Uh, that's the quickest thing. So I'm going to go ahead and go for that. And. I'm going to go ahead and the game is paused, but I'm going to go ahead and stop this video right here. Uh, but yeah, things are things are looking OK. I think we still have. Let's see, there's one, two, three, four. There's another civilization out here somewhere and then possibly also a. Uh, a uh, fallen empire. But I, I'm happy with the amount of space that I have here and I'm about to have a little more, even though it's not going to do me much good because it just has this energy credit thing but it, but what I'm trying to do is kind of stop them from spreading too far this way and then I'm going to come down and build probably another another uh, frontier outpost maybe here I think that would give me all of these for sure all right anyway uh, let's stop the video here and then we will pick it up right here in the next video. Thanks for watching.